Hey everybody, I got something special in the mail today and I can't wait to open it with you. Um, so if you're like me, you have certain authors that you really enjoy and that you collect and that you follow. Um, and of course, for me, as you can see over my shoulder, that is Stephen King. And as I've gotten into the world of fine press, limited editions, small press, limited editions, um, I've also sort of expanded my horizons and become more aware of different publishers of note, publishers that are worth tracking and following because of their impeccable taste and also because of the impeccable quality of the books that they produce and they release. And one of my favorite go-to specialty publishers over the last few years has been Suntup Editions. They did the classic, um, the classic edition of Misery, Stephen King's Misery. They've covered Joe Hill. Um, they've done dozens of books now um, all over the map. <coughs> so Stephen King and Joe Hill at, are in there recently. They did a version of Charlie and the Chocolate Factory by Roald Dahl. So I mean, it's all over the place, but one thing that that is unified, uniform across everything they do is the high quality and the inspired design of their product. So I was really excited. Um, I was really excited several months ago to learn that they were going to be doing a release of one of my personal favorite novels of all time, and that's The Outsiders by S.E. Hinton. Um, it is still not sold out on the Suntub website, so I feel like this might be more of a, a niche title. But the nice thing about how eclectic their releases are is that they're bound to release something that really not just resonates mentally, like, oh, that would be a great investment, or I'd like to have that book on my shelf, but that really resonates in the heart. And I was I was stoked to find out that they were releasing the outsiders um the the artist edition the gift edition is not signed by the author but it is signed by the artist and all of the sun Tup books feature um feature illustrations and each one has artwork commissioned by a different illustrator and the artist editions are which is the the bargain edition is signed by the artist <clears throat> So initially I'd ordered one of those, and then through just a, a kind of a coincidental turn of fate, I was actually able to order the next level up, the numbered edition, with a massive discount coupon from another online book retailer. It would be my first Suntub numbered edition, and I'm stoked because it's one of my favorite novels of all time, and it's signed by the artist, and it's signed by the author, S.E. Hinton. It's very special. And that will be coming sometime in the next few months. But recently on a SunTub Facebook group that I follow, I saw a special deal where the artist, <clears throat> Jeff Echevarria, who did the artwork for The Outsiders, was willing to do additional custom artwork pieces to complement and go, go with the book. So you may know that if the artist associated with a book, um, the book comes out and then they do a special one-off um, drawing or painting or piece of art or whatever inside the book, that's called a remark. Not like remark, a comment that you might make, but R-E-M-A-R-Q-U-E, -E, remark. And that's pretty, that's pretty neat. I only have one remarked book. And it's pretty cool to have it just inside the book. And other times artists will do custom pieces of art that's designed to inlay into the book. It's way, way simpler and it's way cheaper. Nobody has to worry about shipping books <clears throat> to the artist and then shipping them back. The artist I'm sure it's easier, it's more comfortable to just have a flat piece of paper and create a piece of artwork. But anyway, long story short, the artist for The Outsiders, Jeff Echevarria, is willing, was willing, is willing to do 
additional custom pieces of artwork at six by nine inches that will fit inside the book. I doubt I will put this piece of artwork inside the book. Um, I'll probably frame it or do something special with it. But anyway, long story, long, long story short, my artwork came in the mail today and I am so excited to open this up and see what's inside. All right, and you can watch me struggle to open a sealed envelope. <laughs> there we go, okay, cool. So anyway, I think it's covered in stickers that say, handle with care, do not bend, thank you. And miraculously, the post office actually listened. It was handled with care. It arrived to me not bent between two pieces of... Okay, so two pieces of cardboard. Inside, an additional piece of foam. I haven't seen it yet. I just opened the thing. And under this is my artwork. Oh, wow. Cool. So there it is. Jeff asked if there was a character that I wanted him to focus on. And as much as different characters in the novel resonate with me, um, there was no doubt if I had to pick one, then it was going to be Johnny. Um, who was played memorably in the movie of The Outsiders by Ralph Macchio. But Johnny just freaking breaks my heart. Such a cool piece of artwork. It's so moody. And it's so unique too. I mean it looks it looks like a treated like a treated photograph rather than an original piece of art. But man, that is lovely. <coughs> I don't exactly know how I'm going to display it and what I'm going to do with it, but I, I am definitely not going to smush this inside the book when I finally receive it. I'm going to keep it out so that I can enjoy it. But wow, very cool, very cool. Um, I usually don't splurge on additional things like remarks or pieces of art but this was a book that is so special to me and when this opportunity came up um, this original piece of art direct from jeff all in shipping and everything included was 60 bucks which for a special additional um, memento to go along with a story in a book that's so special to me it, it seemed like a heck of a a good deal and something worth taking, um, worth splurging on, worth taking the plunge for. So anyway, there, there you have it. My original piece of artwork of Johnny from The Outsiders to complement my, my numbered edition, um, which is coming here in the next few months, signed by S.E. Hinton and artwork by Jeff Echevarria. So thank you very much. And I'll be back. I'll be back. You better believe I'll be back when that book comes in. And we will take a look at that together too. But until next time, talk to you later. Bye.